This is Minecraft in GTA. My archenemy Mesa has merged the two dimensions and now I must gather resources, avoid monsters at night, and of course, defeat the Ender Dragon. Oof, ow, oh my gosh, my back, oof. Okay, Guido, so here we are in the Minecraft. Um, okay, yeah, I forgot about that. If we want to survive this, Guido, we are gonna have to do the things we do in the Minecraft dimension to survive here in the GTA dimension. For example, we need to find some trees. It looks like there's some down here, and from there, we should be able to gather some wood and start making some tools. We have to be extremely careful, though, because right now, it is daytime. We're totally fine, but give it a few hours and... Yeah, something really bad could happen. Anyway, we've got some trees right here. Let's go ahead and start swinging at them. Uh, oh my gosh, it's actually working. Yeah, there we go, Guido. Okay, so we have plenty of wood now. Let's go ahead and arrange it in the crafting table. And perfect. We now have a wooden sword and a wooden pickaxe. Now all we have to do is focus on... Oh my gosh, my hunger apparently. We're going to make sure we're managing that, Steve. Or we're going to die. Yeah, don't worry, Guido. I'll think of something, I'm sure. Oh my gosh, Guido, it is insanely low right now. We need to find food and we need to find it stat because we are going to be running out of time. And any second now, we're going to start... Oh, yeah, taking damage. Oh my gosh, look. Eat pork chops. Hey, no, come back here. Where are you going? Oh my gosh, adventurers. This guy's actually trying to get away with my cooked pork chops. Ow. Oh no, Guido, he's getting away. He's on the bike. Okay, luckily we've got one right here. Let's go ahead and grab this. Um, no, Mesa. What makes you oh, think that? Okay, adventurers, this is really bad. That guy, the chef, is actually getting away with our pork chops. And oh, we need them any second now or we are going to die. So, Guido, listen, do me a favor, okay? I need you to go ahead and go into the crafting bench. And you need to make us something with a little bit of range. Like a bow, but you have no string. Oh, darn it. Okay, we're going to have to go off the beaten track here for a second then. Oh, land it, land it, land it. Oh, as you can see, Guido, just down this path, there is a cave tunnel. I'm sure there's bound to be some spiders in there. Let's go ahead and take a look. It looks like, wait, I can see them, I think. Yes, there they are. We've got the sword. We've got the sword. Now we can go ahead and take these guys on. Take this and take that. There we go. We got one spider down. Jesus, like three of them, dude. This is insane. They're ganging up on me. Oh, oh my gosh. My hunger's really bad right now. Okay, one more spider. There we go. Now we have enough string to craft ourselves a bow. Now we've got this bad boy. We can go ahead and focus on taking this guy down. Down, boom! Oh my gosh, dude, that was insane! Holy moly, and wow, he is... <laughs> he has just been burnt into a crisp. But as you can see, adventurers, what's not burnt to a crisp is our delicious pork chops. Let's go ahead and munch them, and... Ooh, that was a close one. Now, unfortunately, Guido, that took a little bit longer than I thought. And as you can see, the sun is actually beginning to set. So if we want to survive, we're going to have to go ahead and... Oh, hold on a second. Let me just go ahead and mine this stone. We are going to have to go ahead and build ourselves a house, which is easier said than done. We'll just go ahead and grab ourselves a little bit more wood by bashing this guy's fence. I'm sure he won't mind. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, he does mind. He really does mind. Okay, just give me a second, dude. Listen, listen, listen. Let me just go ahead and explain myself, okay? Just relax. Anyway, Guido, we managed to get ourselves a decent amount of wood right there, so let's go build that house. And this, adventurers, is my brand new house. As you can see, it's fully made out of wooden planks. Took me a little while to find the glass, but that's fine. Oh, and as you can see, I've also upgraded my tools into iron tools. So yeah, your boy has been extremely busy. Of course, I've got these lights to defend from monsters as well. Oh my gosh, like that one! Like that creeper! Okay, let's go ahead and hop inside the house! Dude, that was a close one! Oh, adventurers, those horrible Minecraft Dimension Knights are now here in the GTA Dimension. I mean, look Look at this. My house is just completely surrounded by monsters now. Now, luckily for us, my house is completely sealed shut. So we shouldn't have any issues in. Oh my gosh, there's a zombie. There's a zombie in here. Okay, let's take that thing down. There we go. Okay, one more hit. There we go. And it's down. Uh, oh, oh no. Guido, that is bad. My sword has just been completely broken and... <gasps> Oh my gosh, did you hear that? Sounds like those zombies are actually breaking in. Okay, uh, what do we do? Uh, I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out. We craft something, Steve. Okay, yeah, good idea. Here's all the resources we've managed to gather so far. Let's combine them into the ultimate recipe and... A car! No! Well, 
looks great and everything, Guido, but it sounds like all those monsters just broke through. Okay, we've got to make a break for the car right now. It's now or never. Oh my gosh, look at those zombies. There's so many of them. Okay, I can see the car. Adventurers, there should be a mine shaft right here. If I can get there before these zombies take me down, we should be able to upgrade our iron tools into diamond ones. Oh, what the heck? What was that? Oh my gosh, Guido, what's going on? Dude, oh my gosh, no way. There's actually a zombie on my car. Ow! Oh my gosh, he's biting me. No, no, no. Get off my car. Get off my car. Okay, Guido, we got to get rid of this guy somehow. Okay, let's go ahead and take a nice little stun right here. See if we can land flat on our back. And oh my gosh, he's still attached. This is like the strongest zombie in the world. Okay, we might not have to destroy this guy ourselves because the sun is coming up, which means he's burning. The zombie is burning. Look at him. <laughs> Gosh, we literally have a burning zombie corpse on top of our car right now, adventurers, and it actually smells pretty bad. Now, adventurers, another good point about this is that all the monsters will have, oh my gosh, disappeared, apart from that one. Oh, we just took out that enderman. I guess we better go ahead and see if we've got any loot from that bad boy, because if we indeed do want to stop the ender dragon and Mesa, I'm sure that those could come in handy. Okay, adventurers, here we are, the mine shaft. Now we just need to go ahead and Oh, jeez! Figure some way to get it open! Look out, dude! Yay! Spooky abandoned mine shaft. Here we come. Ah, ah, oh my gosh, that's hot. Diamonds! Come out, diamonds! Come on, come on, come on! Don't you think it's a little bit rude to leave me here in this abandoned mine shaft with absolutely no light sources, completely engulfed by darkness? Ah, oh my gosh! It's happening, it's happening, it's happening! It is Guido! Diamonds! Come to Big Papa Steve! Okay, oh my gosh, there's a lot as well. Let's go ahead and mine this up. Yes, adventurers, we now have full diamond tools! Oh my gosh, creepers! Creepers, there's creepers right behind me! There's so many! I've never seen that many creepers before! Okay, are they still- Oh my gosh, they're actually following me. This is fine, this is fine, we just gotta make it to the exit! Oh no! Oh no, Guido! What are we gonna do? We're trapped! Let me see, let me see, do we have anything we can use? Wait, look! The ender pearl! Okay, let's go ahead and throw it! Oh, oh my gosh, adventurers! No way, look! This is... Oh, the nether! Okay, Steve, come on, you can at least take a few of these guys down. Let's line it up and see if we can actually take them down with my bow and arrow here. It looks like... Oh my gosh, it's just phasing straight through them! Oh, what the heck? What am I gonna do? It's just not working! I... Oh no! Guido, look! It's Enderman! No! Get away from me! Het, what exactly are you talking about, Mesa? Seriously, what is this guy talking about, adventurers? This guy is insane. Wait, what is that? Guido, that's oh my gosh, it's the Ender Dragon! The Ender Dragon is here, and the Ender Dragon is upset. Okay, we've got to get off this roof. We are at maximum risk here. Let's go ahead and just oh, dive down. Uh, oh my gosh, we're soaring down. Okay, we can survive this. We can. Oh wait, parachute, GTA dimension. Right. Oh, that thing is literally right behind me, dude. It set fire to my parachute. We're going down. No. Okay, luckily there's a tree that we can land it. No, never mind. Alleyway it is. Oof. Okay, we've got to find some weapons. We've got to find some weapons to deal with this guy because he's way too strong for my diamond sword and my. Wait, look at this. I have guns. Oh, this guy is so screwed. Come on out, Ender Dragon. I have a mini gun with your name on it. Oh my gosh, Adventurous, he's right above me. There he is. Okay, let's see if we can go ahead and take this guy down. We shot in the tail and he is down. The Ender Dragon is destroyed and the GTA dimension has been returned to normal. Yay! Hey, Adventurous, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this adventure, why not press one of the other two videos on the screen right now? You can also follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram with links down in the description for more adventures.